All right, what is going on, guys? It is your boy IC, and today we're going to be doing a little bit of a review session here. Um, I've done this in the past with some people that I've coached, but tonight I asked my Discord. Um, the link is down in the description, by the way, if you guys want to join. I asked my Discord to send me some links to uh, some control gameplay, and maybe I would review and critique um, you know, the gameplay. So that's what we're going to do today. Um, this is going to be very insightful probably for some players that are trying to get better. And, uh, yeah, anybody who, who, you know, plays this game, I think you'll, you'll be able to learn some stuff, um, hopefully. So, yeah, I have not seen this gameplay. This is going to be my first time watching it through. Um, like I said, I have done this in the past with some people that I've coached. Um, but typically I would kind of watch it through and you know pick some things to talk about and then actually do the review i have not done that um in this you know little thing here so we'll see how it goes but uh yeah appreciate you guys being in uh being here hit that like and subscribe button and let's get right on into it so we're going to be reviewing flexies here he is going against three pro players crack raver and exploits very good players um i don't know who this is that he's playing with but he has one ping so but yeah let's uh let's get into it man let's see how this goes a little asylum here all right let's see what we got going on here all right looks like we're heading towards the m bar out of spawn little mark that's good Okay. Win this fight. Nothing uh, special there. Just made the other team waste a flash. Then we played up. That's nice. Alright. Hold on a second. We are going to rewind this a bit. Um, so we can see this person over here. Rotating up. Got the shotgun reloaded. Here he comes. All right, whoever this person is has a macro, so they mark the Nash on the ground. Um, I'm almost certain. I mean, it's really, really difficult to do this by accident, so I don't know who this was, but yeah. Looks like patches. Okay, um, that's besides the point. All right, exploits who just had the shock died. Playing down here, getting a little aggressive. It's the kill. Okay, let's back that up. So this is like the first actual mistake that I'm seeing. Um, I like like the aggression and everything, especially, um, you know, and you, all right, before we even get into this, like this is the truth too, is like not everybody's playing rank to like try super hard. Um, so sometimes people are just like, you know, whatever. But when you're playing three pros, I'm assuming you're giving your best effort. So I'm going to just be critiquing as if you are giving your best effort. Okay. Uh, playing aggressive here. I like it. Now, this right here, to be honest, this is something that I would do. I would get this kill, and then I would actually back roll, which is what he does. Back roll. Now, instead of... Go like, there's literally no reason at all to be running forward here, okay? Um, absolutely no reason in the world to be running forward here. Uh, we could take cover. We can... I. I don't think anybody's back here on the right-hand side, back here, where the uh, little, like, room is. So I would have liked to see him, you know, back up and play that little room and regain your health. Like, you don't need to throw your life away. You did your job. You got your little kill here. Now use your teammates to win. I, I'll be saying that a lot probably in, in any type of uh, these videos, but you got to use your teammates to win here, man. Like, you, you did your job, right? You got your kill. Exploits did get embarred, remembered earlier. So, like, he's going to be running off the of spawn. There's no need to just head down here. You're already hurt. You did your job. Let's just regain for a second. We definitely do not run back into this fight. All right. See so what we do off spawn here. About 35 seconds left on this hill. All right. I just saw another mark. I just, you know, for my... Boy, 
Why did my controller make me roll right there? Okay, yeah, so I'm pretty sure whoever this is is definitely using a macro. There's no way you're double marking this Nasher by accident. Okay. Swore on everything I love, I did not input a roll right there. He didn't mean to roll, that's what he's saying. It's all right. All right, out of spawn here. There's no need to even, like, be rotating uh, towards this hill. Even though your teammate, like, all right, let's say your teammate didn't get these double nade kills. Like, I still wouldn't be rotating here. I would actually be rotating for positioning, but it's fine. All right, so now I'm going to be honest with you. This is really, really bad, okay? So here it's, like, you know, 50-50 on if you would even go here before these nade kills. But after these nade kills... There's only 24 seconds, right? So, like, kind of like a rule of thumb is whatever number is in this hill, take 10 seconds off of it, right? So, you're rotating to a hill with 14 seconds left. And there's two people dead. Absolutely no reason to rotate over here. Definitely don't want to be doing this. Now we're 3v1ing and wasting a boom shot on that guy. Oh, my God, bro. This is, like, going from bad to worse. All right, a couple people dead. We should be LBing here. Definitely LBing. Um, we need to be using our, all right, you know, we got a TACCOM. Let me, let me practice that. We got a TACCOM here and see when these people are coming off of spawn, man. We should know exactly when they're coming off of spawn. Even though we have like a general, you know, idea, we got to be perfect about this shit. Definitely be pressing your TACCOM. This guy is, Flexies, you got to be pressing your TACCOM more, bro. Straight up. All right, this guy's hurt. I would just rotate through spawn on the right here, right hand side here. I literally wouldn't even fight this. All right, we're gonna nitpick here. That's what we're here to do. So right here, cool, right? Like whatever this guy's here. Instead of sitting here and holding this, I would actually rotate over here through spawn and just let him waste his time there. Now the reason that is, okay, we have two kills. If you run over here to the spawn, that means they can't spawn behind you. And this guy is doing nothing, okay? You have a teammate up top who eventually will probably pinch him. If <clears throat> if not, he will see him, so it's fine as well. Um, but when you're over here and this guy's here, you're forcing them to spawn on the opposite side of the map, okay? So with two people dead, let's just stall this out and basically time this guy. If he ends up hopping through nades and runs towards his teammates and stuff you're going to be able to see that he's not here once you get to this corner, and then you just rotate to the hill and help that fight anyways. But yeah, definitely um, at this moment right here, I would be running through spawn. I would not sit here and fight this. I don't think it's worth it. Even though you got the kill, it's just not, in my opinion, the best play. So now we're rotating through nades. Teammates are all dead pretty much, except for that guy behind you, dead. Yeah. Definitely the better play would have been uh, what I what I said. Definitely uh, rotate, get some map control. All right, we see this guy on the left. Your teammates are fighting. That's one dead. Good try. That's actually a good try. Um, yeah, that's unfortunate, to be honest. Raver is beaming the shit out of you. Right there is when you lost the fight, when he kept you hurt right there, but... That was a good idea. That was good to reset there. I definitely would not have um, stayed in that spot either. So that death, in my opinion, is not much you could do about it. It is what it is. All right. Teammates are still finishing up that fight over there. See which way it goes. Grab the shock. Nades up in seven. Definitely need to be getting to the hill. Okay. Right here, we definitely don't want to be lancering. We want to get physical. Let's get the shoddy out. I wouldn't even have picked up the shock, to be honest. If you guys watch my YouTube videos, you'll see me skipping the shock and stuff pretty often. Um, just sometimes it's not an absolute necessity, and it's more important to get your body physically to the hill. So, again, 28 seconds left on this hill, right? We want to get here as fast as we can, right? That's kind of the entire goal here. Um when your teammate right here is pushed up, that means you need to be with him. This Lancer doesn't do much. Not doing much. Even if you down somebody, it's not doing much. Got to get there physically. Now they got nades. So we know where pretty much the entire other team is. You have a teammate on your left, so you can... Ooh. Okay. 
Yeah, your teammate's not really shooting anybody. I don't know what he's doing, but I'm assuming he uh, he thought that his teammate was going to help him, but yeah, that just didn't happen. I, there should be others coming. should be others coming. Yep, mid. Get aggressive. They do have boom. We saw them pick. Don't get triple killed, please. <laughs> they did pick up boom. Nice. Good kill. There he is. All right, so that's one. We're going to be spawning uh, cross right where that guy is probably. Yep. All right, that's one dead. We know that Savage Canis has boom. It's exploits. He's still alive. Not much you could do here because of the shock. Boom is in the hill, it looks like. Nice. All right, no more booms. <clears throat> See where we spawn here. Might get good. Yep, get good. They're going to be spawning top uh, cat, like to the left. Glance middle. We have no... There we go. I was going to say we have no information mid. Make sure we're watching that. All right, so honestly, like... <clears throat> I think, I think it's like a misconception that lanterning is always good. You know, when you're when you're in a setup, definitely, like it definitely is good. However, in this scenario, we have three people, including us right here, watching the exact same angle and the same lane. So the same lane obviously is the top catwalk, but this is an angle, right? There's only two angles. You're either in the hill or you're out of the hill over here. So the thing is, is Whatever damage that we're going to be putting into them, um, it's going to be from afar, right? So they can literally just spam. And these are pro players, okay? So they're going to spam revive. They're going to get this revive, and they're going to get into this hill, and they're going to retake this shit for free. So what, what, what I would like to see here, instead of sitting here lancering, is I would actually like to get a shotgun and go help our teammate who's in the hill. Let's let's honestly play this corner for a second. If they start going to the hill, we can go right around the corner and get physical. Again, it's a physicality problem here. We're just being a little bit too distant, and I would like to see some more uh, presence uh, towards the hill. Definitely not not as much of this right here. All right, so your teammate's getting ambushed in the hill. He's dead. Your teammate over here is dead. They're going to get these revives, like I said. <laughs> yeah. And that's that's what pro players do, man. That's what they do. That guy marked the uh, he marked the Nasher again. All right, so that guy is for sure using a macro for marking. That is guaranteed. Now, that's the third time in four minutes. None of this really matters. Just running out of spawn. Let's go new here. Nades are up in about 10. I would not wait for these nades. Nice. I would definitely get map control. Way more important. Good play. You could be shooting that guy top. Ooh. Right there was a little thing we could have done. Right here, we see that these people are up here top cat. Let's let's get a mark. Let's peck them a little bit, right? Let's let's tap our lancer. Let's do some damage. It's annoying. You never know how hurt they are. Alleviate some pressure off your teammates. Definitely uh you know, there we go. Two dead. Let's play up right away. I like it. I love it, actually. I love it. Nice. LB. See, now this this right here, we should be LBing. Um, they they still could technically spawn behind us, but now we see them in the background. We should always be LBing. We're not, we're not TACOMing nearly enough. All right. The entire team is leaving the hill to play up. We have nades as well. Somebody hopping through mid. Everybody's dead. This is... Interesting. All right, we got to get physical. That train's going to stop, and the guy coming from nades is going to have a free entryway once that train goes away. We got to get physical. No lancering here at all. As soon as this train's coming, boom, we have to help our teammate, right? This is a 2v2. Instead of a 2v3, because this train is actually helping you right now. Instead of being in a 2v3, this is a 2v2. We got to instantly, instantly, instantly get up to this train track. Put the fucking Lancer away and get active. Like, we have to be fighting right here. No Lancering. Too late. Yep, it's too late. 
Imagine if we were there from the beginning. Never know. All right, now they have a setup. They have boom. When's Embar coming up? We got to be looking around, bro. Got to be looking around. We don't know where Embar's up. When Embar's up. All right, lancing this guy out. Hmm. I don't love how we played that, but it's all right. We got the job done. We still don't know what Embar is up. All right, die to boom. Out of spawn, we got to be seeing when's the power weapon up. All right, your teammate knows. <clears throat> anybody in spawn? Is anybody in this back right spawn area? We got to get some information, man. Let's be looking around the map. Let's be doing stuff. We're going to slow this down. Now, again, Flexies is my friend, so I'm being, you know, a little bit hard on him. But I, you know, this is to make players better. I'm trying to help people. And, uh, you know, obviously, this is the first time I'm doing this. So I want it to be, you know, very to the point, every little detail, right? Okay. We're going to slow this down. And we are going to be very, very honest about this situation, okay? So we have somebody over here in spawn, obviously. I believe somebody else is in the hill. And I think that we know, uh, yeah, this guy's marked up here, top cat. Okay, he has a teammate over here close right just beyond the screen um, who's lancering this guy who's marked. So right here, right, um, I love this. Like, this is perfect, okay? This is this is good. We kill this guy, and then we go help top Cat immediately. Unless he dies, then we help this guy. Um, Cat is the priority, though, because the spawn area is, you know, they're, they're already going to have it because of this guy in the hill. So top Cat walk is definitely the priority after this. Okay. Walk at this guy, hit a good shot, hit every single pellet except for one. Now, it's okay if this guy shoots you, like, we're we we have the shot up here right like we we have the uh you know we get to shoot again before him we don't need to do any wall bouncing no back rolling no roadie running no anything okay we literally shoot him we hold our fucking ground and we finish the job right here we're shooting him we run backwards try to slide sideways and we get punished for it absolutely unnecessary we, we hit a good 74% uh, percent shot. All we have to do is hit one more good shot, a decent shot at that, and we win. Now we're getting punished by the game, get the worst spawn in the game. And, uh, yeah, that was a big fight. It's all good. Nice. Good two shots. That's all we had to do earlier. Got a good shotgun, bro. Let's, let's use it, man. Let's use it properly. When is Embar coming up? When is Nades coming up? When is Boomshot coming up? There we go. Get some information. Move up. We got to alleviate some pressure off of the boys, man. We got to move up with our teammate here. We go flash and get in there. Or flank mid. Either one. Commit. Okay. Not doing anything here, to be honest with you. Okay. So the beauty about respawn game modes, right? Like control are that you get to respawn, okay? So it's okay to die sometimes. Right here, your teammates, they're not in the position to do anything for you, really. This guy is is making a play, okay? Whoever this is, he's doing something that needs to be done because they're in a setup, right? And time is ticking. Your teammates just picked up nades. You got this guy marked and another one in mid, I believe, okay? We have a flash. We throw a good flash. We stun this guy on the right. Now, you have literally two options. I already said it. You either head down the hill and literally full-on fucking commit. We can't just sit here like this guy is doing. I don't think he's just sitting here. But I'm just saying, you cannot just sit here because of the two people in mid. We got to be quick, quick, quick. If we die and we pull these two other people from mid and they look at us, well, guess what? Our teammates who have nades, they're coming through middle with two grenades, okay? They can retake the hill probably by themselves with two nades. So we got to be the playmaker here. We got to be the distraction in a sense. We have to get aggressive. We have to commit. We can't overthink this. You either straight line the fucking hill with your flash. You just stunned him. Why'd you throw it? To be honest, like, you know, if, if we're throwing the if we're throwing the flash and we're stunning him, then we got to use it. Let's commit, right? Let's do something with it. Let's get this hill. 
if that's not the play and you're not comfortable with that, then we got to cut mid and we got to straight line them. We got to get into their face. No Lancer, no dinking and dunking the shotgun. We got to boom, get the fuck in there, get physical. Again, that's that's the, the main word so far, the first seven minutes. We're lacking physicality. Okay, we got to get physical, we got to get into their fucking face, and we got to use a shotgun. Now we're getting just absolutely, you know, destroyed pretty much here. Yeah. Okay. I'll spawn here. <clears throat> now we know where the other team is going to spawn. They're going to spawn right back here. Their entire team is going to be in a setup still. Okay, so here we go. Their whole team's there. All right, we're running away. We wasted our flash. Let's let's keep note of that. Get up there, get physical. Get up there, get physical. All right, Kermit shot. This game's ass. All right, good try. I'd rather you do that. I like the effort. All right, they got boom. Because we, we're not paying attention. We don't know what boom boom is coming up. Gotta be pressing that attack on, man. Hold that motherfucker down. Hold it down. Yeah, all day. Nobody's around you. Shoot that. Or hold the fucking attack on, bro. Like, we gotta be getting some information here. Alright, we got two people here. Do not throw the shock. No. Get physical, baby. Get back here. Don't throw that shock. Get back there, bro. These guys are not going to get stopped by the shock. That shock is not for this moment. That's why I don't pick these up, by the way. Okay, that shock's not winning you this fight. We got two people flying at the hill, all right? They got boom. Let's get to the back. Let's get... That's right, physical. Come on, man. Got to get back here. Get some angles, boys. Now the shock's wasted. The other team's in the hill. And just like that, we're dead. Physicality, boys. Physicality. Man. Yo, Flexies. I'm not going to lie, bro. We're going to have to play some ranked, bro. And I'm not going to lie. If I see you Lancering in ranked, I'm I'm flaming you. Like, you are not allowed pulling out this Lancer, bro. You're not allowed. You don't have a Lancer. Let's just imagine it's not on our back. You better get up there and finish that fucking kill. Flexies. Brother, you beamed the shit out of him. No, 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 no. Again, this is my friend, right? So I'm going to be hard on him. <laughs> Listen, Raver has five HP. Get over here, be a grown ass man, and finish that motherfucker, bro. Come on, bro. What are we doing, man? We're letting him regen, and now what? We're about to get Lancer down. What the hell? Come on, man. We got to play way more aggressive, bro. Way more aggressive. He's a great player, Flexies. He's got great skill, good shotgun. Got to use it, man. Teammate's not playing. That's the least of your concerns right now, respectfully. Nades are up. They got him. When's this M-Bar coming up? When's this boom shot coming up? All right. Teammates got the M bar. I wouldn't know. Only God knows. So that flash. <laughs> uh, baby, baby, baby. Good flash. Listen, listen. This is what I would have done. Throw the flash. All right, cool. Perfect. LTM. Get some damage right here, right? Let's shoot him a little bit. Get some damage. Now we walk up. All right, we hit him again. Boom. All right, he's 99 after we hit him with those first two shots, right? Now what do we do? We create space. Why? Because he's trapped in a corner, and he doesn't have any other option than to get close to you. This is Gears of War. He, he, can't, he can't kill you from all the way over there, right? So he has to get close to you, or he has to run away. We should never, ever, ever be wall bouncing here. Ever. Ever, ever, ever. You have all the advantage in the world, my man. This guy never shot you. Look. 
This guy never shot his gun. He shot you one time. You gave him the kill. We got to hold our shots here. We just walk. Back up a little bit. Get the free kill. Okay? When we have the advantage, we don't give people kills. We don't give them chances. We limit their options, and we take control of the fight, and we finish it. All right, the biggest problem here, and I, I'm going to keep reiterating this. The, this is the biggest problem, okay? Now, I'm not, like, I actually genuinely know Flexies is a good player, but this is the problem. We're making this game so much more difficult on us, like, th than it needs to be, okay? This is, we're just making this match everything about it, from the fights to the rotations to the power weapons to the hills to the setups. Everything right now is just it's too difficult and for no reason okay right out of spawn hold lb let's like let's read the map a little bit right it's like football let, let's read the field like soccer let's read the field we got to get some information here man we need some information the only information that we have right now is Raver just killed somebody over here so he's over there somewhere your teammate's dead and you have a teammate here and x boys is marked that's all we got we don't know when the power weapons are coming up. We don't know, you know, like, let's say boom is up in 15 seconds. Are you still rotating to mid? No. You're going to rotate over here to boom. Let's say M-bar is up in five seconds. Where are you going to go there? You got to be asking yourself these questions, right? Well, you're never going to ask yourself these questions if you don't LB. You got to hold this LB button running out of spawn. TACOM, 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 man. Let's go. Got to be better than that. I would turn around and I would fight that guy behind us. Right here, right here, I'm I'm not gonna lie, like the best case scenario is we're gonna sit down here and get trapped underpass. Like this guy's still over here. They still have a teammate over there, they got a teammate in aids. Like we're this is one of those moments where we gotta make something happen considering they have two hundred and thirty three points. We can't contain or contest the hill from over here. So we got to make something happen. We got to fight for map control. That's why this game mode is called control. We got to get control of the map, and then we get control of the hill, okay? Trapping ourselves under pass or even just dying right here is not control of the map. We need control of the map. Straight line the guy up top. Good. Go, go, go. Fight him. Good. Perfect. Now let's see where they spawn. Hold on a second. Who marked that Nasher? Who marked that Nasher? Whoever's Lancering. This guy. Whoever that was. Okay. We got boom. Boom is down. You have somebody straight lining you here. There you go, Creed. Perfect, bro. See what I mean? Like, I don't even like the back roll, to be honest with you, but it's okay. Like, creating space is creating space, I guess. I just don't like the back roll because you can't shoot. Let's just strafe it out. You know what I mean? Strafe it out a bit. Make him miss. You just... He just can't chunk you, right? Like, whatever. All right, back rolling is not the end of the world. Cool. All right, perfect. Get that kill. All right, everybody's dead for the most part. Let's press LB, man. Let's press LB. We got the hill. Let's get some information. When's the Zenbar coming up, bro? Where are they spawning? We got somebody to him. We got somebody on the left. One's dead. Where are they spawning? Where's the rest? They could get split spawns easily here. All right, looks like they're all left. We still don't know what Embar's up. We're out of the hill. Lancer and done, done about 23 damage here. There we go. Get the down. Cool. Oh, yeah. Yeah, whoever that was. Oh, this guy right here, I'll put it on my life. Matter of fact, I'll put it on God. He has a macro. What are we doing right now, man? Come on, Flexies. What are we doing right now, bro? We got to get down there, bro. They're getting points. How do we win the game? We got to get to 300. 
Doing doing a lot of nothing right now, man. Alright, good try. <clears throat> it's it's a domino effect, right? If we're down here doing the right things, we kill these guys, then we go up here, we pick up this M bar with a smile on our face. Like there's no there's no fight about it. We're good. We helped our teammates. Right now, we're just Lancer and we're pistoling, we're doing nothing. They're accumulating points, killing your teammates, and getting the M bar. They came into your house, took the TV, grabbed a sandwich, and said, fuck you on the way out. We got to do something. Put your hands up and fight back here, man. We got to make some better decisions, bro. Long story short, let's go, man. Okay, got the they uh they got the M bar here. They got boom. Booms out. We LB, that's nice. No more booms. They got the hill, they got M bar. They got our T V. It's too late to flank. We gotta make a shake, baby. Get up there. Go. Probably GG's. Oh, hold on a second. Oh my god. Oh, there should be two people up here. That guy's marking an Asher through the smoke on the ground. <laughs> All right, we got life. They need six points. We need Jesus. Nades are about to be up in five. I like this. Let's skip the nades. I do like this. As soon as one of these people... That, all right, go. Run, run, run. Go get nades. Run. Go to nades. Instantly. Go. Go, 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 go. There you go. Get these nades. Parlay that boom. Nope. I don't like these nades. I don't like those nades. Even though it worked, I don't like the nades. Felt unnecessary. Definitely didn't need to throw them. Sorry. Got the boom. Got the setup. We got... Listen, we got fucking life. We hold this shit down. It's 260 to 290. We got life. Let's hold this shit. Teammate's dead. We got boom, remember. We got boom. So we got to be a little bit... There we go. I was going to say, we got to be a little bit passive here. But your teammate did good right there with that boom. Your other teammate's dead. We got to win this. Nice. Get to the hill. Trying to steal some kills. I, I respect that. Definitely respect that. Oh, do not fight this. Get out. Go, go, go. All right. Two people hopping. Nice. I would wait for your teammate here. Back A's right hand. That seems about right. That seems about right. All right, your teammates win that. Nice. LB. 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 One down bar up. I like it. I like it. Listen, this is, this is also a rule of thumb with any grenade, okay? We Lancer before we throw these nades. Okay, damage before... The nades. No, it doesn't matter with the shock. You know, incense is probably the only one that you would actually actively run around with it in your hand. Okay, we gotta get some damage, man. Especially in a game mode like this where it's about control. Let's lancer them, stall them, accumulate points, and then when they get close, they gotta run through the shock. Let's not just throw the shock, and now the shock goes away, and they still have all the time in the world. We gotta put some damage in, put some pressure on these mo motherfuckers, man. Let's lancer, bro. We don't need to be holding the shock. We might lose a game here. Nope. Wasted on the M bar. Now they got nades. Okay. A lot of right stick being pressed here and pushed and pulled. Let's. 
Try to use our left stick more. God, bro. Raver's pistol is nice. Unfortunate death, I would say. Your teammate should definitely be near you. Wow, we actually won this game. Yeah. We need more of them. I'll be honest with you, Flexi. We, we, we need more of those. All right, we won the game. <clears throat> God is with us. Listen. Listen. Just some Just some things to note here, okay? Number one, absolutely number one at the top of the list. We need more information on the map. We need to be TACCOMing 100% more often. Fuck that. 300% more often. We need to be TACCOMing at all times. At any time. If you're not shooting, you're TACCOMing. Okay? You need to TACCOM. Number two, we need to stop spazzing out with our right stick so much. You know, you're you're itching to wall bounce. You're, you know, you hurt somebody and you just want to start fucking dancing. Let, let's relax, okay? Let's relax. Let's let's apply some pressure. Let's brick them. And then let's just aim with our left stick. Let's move with them a little bit, okay? We don't need to move with our right stick so much. Okay, that's number two. Number three, go get that fucking TV back, bro. Like, you won the game, but I promise you, they are still watching SportsCenter on that shit literally right now. They own that shit. Matter of fact, they might have sold it. They might have stole it and sold it. Hope you guys enjoyed this video, man. Shout out to Flexies. I appreciate the uh, video, man. If you guys want to see more of these, let me know down in the comments. If you guys want to send me a link to your little video that you want reviewed, join the Discord and message me privately. Love you guys. Hit that like and subscribe button, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace.